Hi friends, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. Well, welcome to day six of my 12 days of Christmas series. And today we are going to create some totally dazzling ornaments for my Christmas tree. Now I am an affiliate for Totally Dazzle and I asked them to send me some items because I had some amazing ideas for this Christmas season. So these are all of the roaches, some of their bedazzled um, medallions. So these are the items that we are going to use to create these amazing ornaments. I'm coming home for Christmas. Yes, I'm coming home to For this DIY, I am using these beautiful brooches. These brooches are so incredibly pretty and I love them because they are gold um you get two in a pack and so i chose this because i'm using gold throughout my home and throughout my holiday decor and these were perfect totally dazzle has a huge array of brooches and medallions for you to choose from so i was so happy when i saw these now what you're also gonna need is your glue gun some glue sticks and the ribbon of your choice i'm using um, a half an inch thick ribbon because because these are actually brooches we're going to use one of the pin hoops that is what we're going to use to attach our ribbon okay so the first thing we want to do is take our brooches and make sure that our brooches are in the same direction so you see I have these brooches and I'm going to attach them horizontally and I am going to attach them they're like notches and they should like fit into each other almost perfect and that is how we're going to attach them um together and we're going to hot glue them now i'm just going to apply a very generous amount of glue not enough so it'll like pile up but enough so that it can adhere to each piece and then I'm gonna place it um, down so that it can dry. And then I'll begin working on my next piece. Isn't this beautiful? It looks like a really nice pair of fancy formal earrings. These items are so pretty. And if you're creative, you can create a lot of different items using these. So now that they're drying, I'm going to get I woke up this morning. I looked outside my window where children lighting up the Christmas tree and the snow is falling. It reminds me of the good So here I was trying to decide whether I wanted to tie these in a bow or if it looked better in a knot. So I'm going to show you two of them with bows and then probably one with the knot and you would just have to wait and see which design I decide to go with in my um, office tree reveal video so here are my ornaments and they are so amazingly stunning they look like something that you would actually wear to a fancy event but I am dazzling up my tree and these are going to be perfect for my office so guys I wanted to share with you these um, ornaments you see some of them I have created a vertical and some of them are actually horizontal so it is like up to you whatever you would like to do and then I'm going to show you how they will look on a tree not my tree but a tree and they look really nice and as you see the bow kind of stands out a little bit and it is really cute this way but I think on my tree I'm just going to tie it in a simple knot and I think that would be perfect for my tree and my office so stay tuned for that office reveal if you are not subscribed to my channel go ahead subscribe I have so many more great DIYs cooking videos and house tours coming up for this holiday season if you are an existing subscriber guys you already know that i love you i appreciate you and i want to thank you for riding with your girl i also want to thank 
totally dazzled for sending me these items. I really appreciate you helping me out with my totally dazzling ornaments and other decor that I will be sharing in this year's 12 days of Christmas. And guys, that's it. If you enjoyed today's video, please give me a thumbs up. Once again, if you're new to Wani's house, I would love for you to subscribe. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell so you will not miss any of my exciting uploads. So guys, I'm about to leave. But before I go, you know what I always say. The next time you're in town, you can always stop by Wani's house. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.